Hey guys, so I am at the Inglot store for the JLo launch in collaboration with Inglot and I'm about to get some powder on because I feel like I went a little too light down here. So they're gonna apply some of the new powder on me. They relaunched some colors. I'm gonna show you the whole collection in a second. But first, he's gonna apply some makeup on me and I'm here for it. I feel super popping today. I filmed this look, by the way. So. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? You? Look at Angie though. <laughs> We're reunited. Isn't she with so the look. pretty? Angie's so pretty. I've learned so much from Angie. I always talk, this is Angie. This is the girl I'm always talking about on my channel. Follow her, Miss oh, Angie I Farm. I the wine on myself, but. Oh, okay, uh, bye. Look how bad he is. Right? Look at that glow. Hey. Yes, follow her. Wait, did you change your hair? I'm just yeah, noticing yeah, that now. Oh, Elsa? Elsa? Elsa who? And then this one is the, the freaking bomb at the musically. Oh, that was found musically yeah. for me. She makes me want to do those things, but I don't know how to do them. So I literally ordered this yesterday and it already came in. I ordered it from Best Buy, but this is a Mophie power station. I left my Mophie, I think, at a dinner, like during BeautyCon weekend or something. I don't know. I think someone took my charger and my cable. So I bought this one. I wanted to get the one that I had, which was like a nice little skinny one. It was very small, so it fit in like clutches and stuff. It was like kind of like a little rectangle. And now I have to go buy an Apple, another Apple cable, because I'm like always, my phone's always dying. Like right now, it's literally charging. I bought this case, by the way, like the dusty um, pink. So I thought that would like go cute together. What was I saying? Oh. Like right now, it's literally on a portable charger. Even though I'm home, I'm usually like walking around with my phone. So it's just easier to just have this. This one is from Amazon and it's Anchor. And it's pretty good. But I want to get like one more Mophie or just like a small one, like a nice thin one for like when I'm going out certain places that this won't fit. But yeah, I was like, that was pretty fast shipping Best Buy. So kudos to you, Best Buy. I don't know. I think they're like really, really good with their customer service. So just wanted to show y'all my new case. I heard these get really dirty because it's kind of like a little bit of like a, I don't know, uh, suede, not suede, rubber, like a soft rubber so it gets dirty easily, but I'm going to try to take care of it. But yep, it is 3.49, it is Thursday, and I'm cleaning up. I got my hair done yesterday, so I kind of want to film a video because every time I get a blowout, I'm like, let me take advantage, get some videos done. It's so nice out, and look at this little kid. Don't worry, the screen is closed, and I watch him while he's there, but we're talking about you. I'm talking about you. Yeah, I'm gonna try to film something. I wanna film while it's still bright out because my videos come out so much better. I just need to like find the energy to do so. Yeah, I'm gonna just clean up and film. That is today's day. I feel like meditating today. Random, I just wanted to share that with you, but. All right, bye. Okay. You look awesome. Hi guys, so today is Tuesday and I'm about to get my lips recharged. I actually put so much lip balm on, so my lips actually look really plump, but I'm getting my top lip just filled in just a little bit. It's been over three months, but I still have filler. Like, it's really natural. I come to Dr. Leslie Gersman here in the city on the Upper East Side. Yeah, Upper East Side, and I'll leave her address down below, but she's the only person that I trust with my lips because she does such a natural job. So usually I do one full syringe. I'm probably just gonna do maybe a half or even less, so they can look like this. Like right now I have lip balm kind of over my line So I kind of want my lips to look like this Dr. Leslie Gersman is an amazing, amazing doctor She's also going to do Botox in my jaw again for the TMJ You guys know that I got it done once before And it's been over three months and I noticed dramatic results So my ears have been hurting a little bit more again I feel a little bit more tension in my jaw So I know that the Botox helped because for the last like 
five months I think it's been maybe four or five months I have not complained about the pain my jaw has been so much better so I'm gonna get Botox in my jaw my lip filled in a little bit one time I got my nose done like just a little bit of filler to make it straighter but don't think I'm gonna be doing that today so I will be taking you through the process I'm excited I love Dr. Leslie Gersman she's so sweet her whole set up like her whole office is beautiful so aesthetically pleasing I've showed you before but I'm gonna show you quickly right now everything is just so clean she's very professional you guys can come for a consultation she'll let you know you know what she thinks like I remember when I walked in I was like I want this I want that she was like let's do this like this will complement your face this will be better for that so she's very very sweet personable but also very professional which I love so yeah she's here in the city literally right near the college that I went to Hunter so I am just waiting to go in right now and then she's probably gonna numb me and then we are gonna get started I'm very sick today so I try to pull my Myself together and put a little makeup on but I still feel like crap inside but it is such a beautiful day I'm so happy with the weather here in New York it's like 75 or 80 degrees right now and I'm like hot but you know when your jacket's part of the outfit so I kept my jacket on but tomorrow's gonna be like almost 90 which is insane so very happy about that it's so sunny and beautiful out which always makes me so happy it puts me in such a good mood so I'm gonna quickly just show you around before my appointment. So this is one of the rooms where the facials go down. I've actually gotten a facial done here too. So this is just the bed, a beautiful lamp. So this is one of the other rooms that you can do a facial at. I got mine done here, but don't you just love like the black and white? Even the floor is gorgeous. I got my chucks on. I love this rug and look at this little area. Look at the waiting area. Stunning, I love it. Even this little table, I've showed you guys this before. We got some lemon water. She sells products here, skincare products. She has her own line, which is awesome. Here's the bathroom. Cute little details. Hi guys, so I'm inside with Leslie. And she is just numbing me up. We were talking about how the Botox helped so much that I just, I noticed that I stopped complaining about it. And then, so it kicks in like about a week or two after getting the Botox, but then I noticed that I had so much less tension when I would chew. I was able to eat better, sleep better, less headaches, so just better like living overall. If you do suffer from TMJ, definitely consider it. Um, I tried a mouth guard. Mouth guards fall off when you're sleeping, so that didn't really help. And you know, getting like veneers and like that, that's really expensive. So this is just a great alternative to those two things, and I found that it helped a lot. And also, of course, the pro is that your jaw looks so much better like my contour lines looked sharp and they just I felt better so we are just numbing me up she removes a little bit of makeup because basically she's going to place the um, Botox right into the jaw so I'm gonna actually open up and when she, where she sees that kind of clicking that I guess tense area that's where she's gonna apply the Botox so I love it I've gotten lots of questions from you guys concerns like oh my god what happened after did did it hurt more or like does your face look different nothing it just went back to kind of normal but actually it's only been well it's been five months and my TMJ is still not as bad as from before so I still feel like it lasts longer they say it lasts three months I found that it lasted longer for me my lips too so as you can see my lips look pretty good they look really good compared to what I first started out with that's what I love about coming here is that she's all about natural results but they last really long because it's like quality. So I'm gonna show you guys the process. It doesn't hurt because you're numbed. You can choose to be, you know, not numbed, but I'm always here for the numbing. And um, yeah, I found that it helped a lot. And also with my lips, I found that just applying liquid lipstick is so much easier because I don't have as many lines. A lot of people just think lip filler is just for size, but also for hydration. I suffer from dry lips, very like dehydrated lips. So this will help a lot. And you guys will see that in my next videos how much of a change is gonna be for my contour and also my lips and how full they look, how plump and like hydrated they'll look. So we are here, now being numbed.
So I'm at this spot called Mini Grill and it looks amazing. Um, spinach noodles? Is it that? Yeah. Oh, zucchini. Which are the spinach noodles? Oh, which one do you think I should get? Spinach noodles? Okay. I'll do that. Ooh, I'm excited. If y'all are Peruvian, you know green spaghetti, that's my jam. Alrighty, so here's my bowl. I got the uh, zucchini noodles with an egg. I didn't know it was gonna be like that. I kinda wanted egg whites, that's fine. It's just an egg there. Tofu, broccoli. They let me try the sauce mix, so I loved it. So I got the, it's a pesto sauce mixed with a herb. And then just some sparkling water. This is my lunch. And then I'm gonna go get my nails done, so I gotta be quick. All right, bye-bye. So I just finished eating. It was so weird eating because my lips are so numb. And I look crazy with this uh, makeup removed right here. I should have brought like a brush. My nail lady's gonna be like, what the hell did you do? <laughs> kind of a harsh contour there, buddy, but that's fine. So I just finished eating. It was so good. I finished it so fast. So now I'm gonna go to do my nails. I hope you guys can hear me. The music is kind of loud in here. So y'all know I got no business doing here in Harmons, but they have my deep conditioner that I haven't used in so long and it's 10% off. So it's a win and I'm getting this Eco Tools dry brush to exfoliate myself. But look at Harmons. Life is great in here. Okay, so I'm getting some rope testing too because your girl's cough is pretty nasty right now. I'm like, I want everything. I want drops. Let me get out of here, all right? Let me just bounce. So I went to Bath and Body Works today and I went with my mom and we did a little bit of damage. I ended up with three bags and they had a sale, buy two candles, get two free. So we couldn't resist. We had no candles left and my mom loves candles. So we have salt flower, cactus blossom, three coconut sandalwood, cause we really like that one. Honey Silka and Freesia, which actually smells a lot like rose water and ivy, which I did get here. Sunny Fig, Pink Prosecco, Sunset Pier. I like these, the um, blends, because they're like custom and they're like unique. They're not like scents that Bath & Body Works ever had before. Sea Salt and Linen, Stress Relief for my mom. So yeah, those are the candles that we picked up and we didn't get anything else. We literally just got candles because we already have room sprays. I ordered the rose water and ivy sprays on, on eBay again because they're always sold out. And yeah, we have like the wall plugs actually. So all we got was candles. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these bad boys away. Hi guys, so I'm on my way to buy Salon Spa to get a keratin treatment. And I think I'm getting a thermal cut even though I just cut my hair. I'm gonna ask if I really need it. It's like um, a special kind of haircut that kind of like helps you with your split ends. But I literally just got my haircut like two weeks ago or a week ago. So I am in Washington Heights and I had two Ubers cancel on me. I took the train here and then I figured it'd be faster, but I'm going to hop on the Uber and I'll see you guys at the salon. probably gonna blow dry it, straighten it, and then my hair will be super straight. So he wrapped it with this like aluminum kind of thing to really like seal it in. Super straight hair. Here I come. Bye. 
and then she's gonna go over it again with a flat iron, but my hair is super shiny. She asked the dreaded question, how much can we cut? And y'all know me, I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> so I literally just cut it, but it wasn't a good job. Like, it was just a quick little trim. So I decided. <laughs> and they are heated. Plugged in right now, so they're not regular systems. <laughs> with onion, avocado, egg, and cheese. I'm definitely not gonna finish this. And of course, Hugo the Chinola. So I'm about to get my monthly facial. I'm here at Adara Skincare. This facial that I'm doing today, I'm not gonna get too many extractions because I am leaving to Vegas. So I break out really, really easily. So she's going to just kind of do some serums, exfoliation, just make sure the skin is clean and glowy. And then I will come back probably after I go to Vegas for extractions. But my skin isn't too bad right now, so. I don't really need them. So let's go ahead and get into it. So I just finished my facial with Adara Skin Care and my skin always looks amazing when I walk out of here. I did have a couple of little like blockages I guess, like clogged pores around here. We decided not to do too many like extractions today just because I do have an event and I'm traveling this week so I didn't want my skin to like, you know, be sensitive because I have very sensitive skin but that's the thing, like coming here, my skin has... <clears throat> But that's the thing about coming here is that Marianne, she will literally assess your skin and work with it. So if you have sensitive skin, oily skin, dry skin, acne prone skin, there's different treatments for different skin types. And it's important to come once a month. Sometimes I come twice a month. Like I'll come mid-month just for like, you know, if I need like a glow or something for like an event or something special is coming up, then I'll come twice. But once a month is ideal. Today we did the mask which I love getting that like really cooling. I think it's, I don't know what it's called, but it's the mask that goes all over your face. But there's different ones even for that. Like there's one for sensitive skin, which is the one that I get. She applied a really nice serum on my skin. We did exfoliation. She applied the machine on me like you guys saw to remove all of the dead skin cells. And this like in a two, three days, my skin's gonna be super duper clear. 
Um, I get a little bit sensitive just because I have very sensitive skin. So the day of, I'll be a little bit rosy, but it goes away. It's all about, you know, coming every month consistently just so that your skin could be at its best. We also did this eye treatment, which really opens up the eyes. Last time I got it done with the machine, but today she did like a manual hand massage on my eyes. And so this really opens up the eyes. It hydrates, it removes any puffiness that you have underneath. So if you suffer from, you know, darkness or puffiness from under your eyes, that treatment is amazing. I suffer from sinuses. I suffer from sinus congestion and also I get puffy because of that. So that really helps me out. It really opens up my eyes. I feel like I even have more space between my eyebrow and my eyes which helps when doing my eyeshadow so I love coming here I will leave the information down below I'm gonna just be sharing with you my facial that I get every month just because I want to show you guys that consistency is, is gonna get my skin at its best and you guys have been noticing that my skin has been looking a lot better and it's because I'm, I've been coming here and also I've been using the products that Marianne gave me from here like her own line which I'm gonna be sharing with you so yeah I just wanted to share how my skin looks afterwards this is also how my hair is drying after my keratin i did have it up so it has like a little bit of like a wave but my hair is frizz free super smooth i realized i didn't share with you how my hair is air drying if i just air dry it and just brush it out it dries straight but as you can see i still have like some volume and i just i love how it looks like it looks like i styled it so i am heading out and i will catch you in a few hey guys so i just got to queen center mall with my mom <laughs> and we are gonna go into Express and I'm going to do some shopping. I have some trips coming up and the weather's getting nice so I need to do some spring slash summer shopping. I think it would be helpful to share with you kind of like my thought process when I'm shopping because I know you guys like my style even though I consider myself No, no, the bus is passing. Even though I consider myself very plain and basic, y'all like my style. So I'm gonna share with you my shopping trip. So let's go ahead and go inside. Oh yeah, a brand new stuff. Alrighty, let's get started. Taking out dresses that have the stripes going up and down. It'll give you the illusion of like a longer body. If you have the stripes going this way like that, it'll make you look wider. And I really love that it has a little belt because then you can cinch your waist in and create more of a curve. This is cute with just like some wedges or some like brown sandals. I think it will look really cute. So I'm gonna pick this one up. So I grabbed this top. This color is gorgeous. It's showing up a little bit more peach on camera, but it's more of like a salmon. It's so, so nice. So I love this. This top would go really nicely with a white jean or a white short and then maybe some wedges. I think these complement each other really nicely. Or you could even do this with like a regular jean color. But I really like how this looks very summer. Um, and if you're going out at night, maybe you can do a sandal heel, maybe like a nude sandal heel and like a nude bag. I also love this white jean jacket. It's almost like a little bit cropped, a little bit distressed. Just a nice relaxed feel. You can roll up the sleeves and this looks really pretty with a sundress. Dress. You can wear this with pretty much anything you can wear with dark denim on the bottom I also picked up to try on this jean jacket. I love jean jackets You guys already know that especially for like summer at night I just I think it just completes any outfit This one's really cute because it has these like really pretty studs and I just love the light wash on this one I don't have a light wash uh, Denim jacket these shorts are super cute with like a tank top tucked in I love this color, it looks so good. Maybe with like a pop of yellow, like an earring or like a red earring, like something really bright to kind of just like pair with this would be really cute. Or you can do like a nude tank top with this and then like brown wedges, I think that would look really nice. This little set is super cute as well. I love the stripes again and it's really, really nice and thin for like the summer. So if you're going like on a vacation, this set is perfect. Um, I don't think I could, maybe like I can wear like a strapless bra with this because it's a very like thin spaghetti, but I just love that it's like a matching set really really comfortable especially like if you go on vacation and you get like a tan or a burn this is the type of clothes you want to wear because it's nice and lightweight so I'm gonna go ahead and try those on this is the dress that I shared with you before I love the sleeves how they kind of go out a little bit it's really girly and pretty and again I love that it has like this belt this is another really cute like girls brunch or lunch kind of outfit with some wedges and maybe some statement earrings I think that would look really pretty so I'm gonna go ahead and try these pieces on <laughs> Oh, 
So when I pick jeans, I always roll them up at the bottom just because it makes me look a little bit taller. Even if they hit me right at my ankle, I always just roll them up. And I just love when my ankles show, especially for a shorty like me. I like that these ribs aren't super open. And you can see they have to stress, but they're not like holes per se. So this is the next pair of jeans that I'm trying on. As you can see, the bottom, if I was a little bit taller, these would have worked like this, but I like them hemmed. And I just feel like it looks cleaner, but you guys can let me know. Or I can always go to the seamstress and just kind of hem them a little bit so it's a little bit skinnier on the bottom, just because it's supposed to hit me a little bit higher, but since I'm so short, they actually do carry short for express jeans, like short, regular, and long. I think only online or in some locations. These are regular, but these are like cropped leggings, so they're super comfortable, very soft, so I love these, and I'm definitely gonna get them. So this is the jean jacket. Super soft, super comfy. I love the stud detail on this. It has these really cute like low pockets, so it's super comfortable. You can just throw this on with anything. I love tops like this because you can really cinch your waist in and you can show up the girls. I probably wouldn't wear these with these because these are distressed shorts. I would wear this more with like a plain white bottom or a plain bottom just because this is already a lot. So these are all of the items that I'm getting. I'm getting this shirt, white jeans. These jeans I really liked. The ripped jeans, a white um, jean jacket, black tank top, this jean jacket, and then the blue jacket. This is the damage. <laughs> Yay! What up? What up? <laughs> so this is my cousin, Manu, also known as Troops Edmundo. Manny Fresco. <laughs> so he's here from Florida yeah. and he got the crest white strips yeah. advanced yeah. on. Hey, yeah. yeah, yeah. hey, hooking yeah. it up. We're about to do a little baby facial. Give him some brand new skin. Got the Jesus hair. <laughs> look good, look good. This he just cut his beard light. down, but your hair awesome. looks really light. Look at that natural. Wow. I mean, My brother had it light, but I never had hair like that. But yours is definitely lighter. It's lighter very curly. Tips. My tips are really light. Cool, cool. I'll put Manu's uh, Instagram right here. He's but not really, you know, but you don't really post on there. But that's good. Back on. Back on. You don't want a guy that be posting all the time, right? That's all right. <laughs> no selfies. <laughs> all right. Bye. So we got them all hooked up now. No, okay. <laughs> Wait, does it burn a little bit? Doesn't burn. I'm just not used to having stuff so close to my eyes. Oh. <laughs> There's a lot to handle. It's like a reflex right shot, now. So know? we got the crest white strips yeah. burning. Burning my teeth. <laughs> and then and then this patch is like it's it's chilling on your eyes. It's like cold. But it's, it's weird. I feel like I have like some slugs underneath. Some my slugs. <laughs> just hanging out, but it's, it's gold. So yeah, I mean I it has 24 karat gold in it. So and you know I like gold, so yeah. it, it works out. <laughs> Everything works out. Now that he took the mask off, we're putting a little bit of the Summer Fridays jet lag mask. I mean, you did just get off the plane. I did get off. So the plane. it's jet it lag. Works. Yeah. I definitely feel the jet lag. <laughs> well, this will help you not feel the jet lag. <laughs> See? Upward motion. Yeah. Upward motion. And now we're also going to do the Sunday Riley CEO moisturizer. I actually have a full size, but might as well finish this up. Alright. So this is like a vitamin C cream. Oh, you really have to like work that in though. Oh, it's still in there? Yeah, it's still white. Oh. <laughs> this is good because it'll kind of like make it look a little bit dewy. Okay, okay. okay. And you get a nice good amount of that. And just rub it all over your face. Okay. A lot on the forehead. Forehead. Mm -hmm. Rub it in. Rub it in, rub it in. And this will give you a nice glow too. Awkward motions. Yes. He knows what's up. Yeah, this? <laughs> yeah, yep. Lip mask. It's gonna look a little weird, the color. Wow. <laughs> it looks mad purple. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. Your lips are a little purple. Alright, so just leave it there for a little bit. And then later you can take it off. Brand yeah. new. You see the purple? No. I feel brand new. Skin looks brand new. Rose over here, beautifying me. Yeah. Got Sousa here. And she brought the pizza. Coco thinks he's gonna eat. Baby pizza is life. Yeah, yeah. We always get the baby pizza because it tastes better. Bon appetit. And a ginger ale she brought me. Yep. How sweet. Everybody get your motherfucking roll on. I don't show you she doesn't want no slow so. Had a man last year, life goes on. But it's alright, you it's alright, it's a short life. Yeah. Come with Susa, Chuk, yeah, yeah. and Mikhail. Cheers, guys. 
do it for the vlog, do it for the vlog. Blue moon, blue moon. What are you guys drinking? Estella. Estella, you too? Lagunitas. Oh, cheers.